What happens when you put a geode in a rock tumbler? I guess today we're gonna find out. Welcome back to Will It Tumble, where I answer questions that nobody asked. Except this one was actually very highly requested. If you're not already familiar with geodes, they're rocks like these that look like regular old rocks on the outside, but when you crack them open, they're full of beautiful sparkly crystals. I want to keep this process as true as possible to normal rock tumbling because they're actually going to go through all four rock tumbling stages from coarse grit to polish. We'll see if they actually turn out shiny in the end. I don't think they will, but we'll see. I'm kind of hoping that we'll be able to grind off the whole bumpy outer layer revealing perfect quartz spheres that are still hollow in the middle so that when we crack them open, it still looks like a geode. That's my vision for this. We'll see what happens. The first stage of rock tumbling uses coarse grit, and this is usually where most of the shaping action happens and where you see the most dramatic visual change in the rocks. I suspect that after this stage, they'll look pretty different, but honestly, I'm not sure in what way. I'm adding in the whole geodes as well as a few that are already broken open just so I can see what happens to the exposed crystals. Previously, when I've tumbled things with druzy crystals like these, they've sadly just been worn down completely smooth, but I think it's worth the risk so that we can compare them to the whole ones at the end. I'm adding water and three tablespoons of coarse rock tumbling grit as per usual and leaving them to tumble for the next week. But don't you worry because the results are coming up right now. The geodes tumbled in stage one for nine days and let me tell you, they made the most of those nine days. These look crazy. I did not expect this much of a change just in one stage. It looks like pretty much all of the outer layer came off on these. Oh, you can see the hole in that one. Yeah, it's got slurry draining out of it. These ones look like what I expected these to look like. You can almost see the crystal structure through it. Like in here, there's crystals inside. If I crack these open, they'd look gorgeous. But we have to wait. This must have been one of the ones that I already cracked open because it's flat on this side. Oh, there's another hole in this one. Very interesting. Now I'm going to continue tumbling these to see if they ever actually get shiny. Stage two, coming soon. 